ever since I got to Barcelona, I've been so depressed. I'm not even in the starting 11. Ah, man, I hate feeling like this. Let me see if I can find a movie on TV that would cheer me up. I want to watch a funny movie. Maybe an action-packed movie. What is this? I've never seen this movie. So this is a love story, I bet you. Oh, oh my goodness. Look at this girl. She got a banging body. Oh, my days. What what the? Ah, oh, oh, your face is busted, girl. No, no, no. I'm just kidding. Where you going? Come back. No, I was just kidding. Oh, oh, Rico Suave. Who's this guy? Can't sleep either. That's your pickup line, bro? Making yourself crazy with this. Oh, she's never fallen for that, bro. This is a terrible movie. Shh. Just take five minutes. Five minutes? <laughs> That's all you need, bro. Five minutes. Where you going? Come back. I was just kidding, bro. You're exactly what I need. Right oh, my now. goodness. She's falling for him. Okay. Ah, this is not what I wanted to watch. I wanted to watch something funny, man. I'm done with this bullshit. A lot of drama going on here at Barcelona. Messi could be on his way out. Skill struggling to get a spot in the starting 11. But for the next game against Valencia, Skills is in the starting 11. Pedro playing left wing, Skills playing center forward, Messi playing right wing, Fabregas, Sergi Busquets, and Inesta in the midfield. No Chavi. Does this manager know what he's doing? I don't know, man. I'm kind of I'm kind of a bit iffy. I just don't know about this manager. He's always sitting Skills. Now he's sitting Chavi. No Sanchez in the lineup. Kinda wish where Pedro was playing, Sanchez was, but it's not going down that way. Either either way, Pedro, Messi, and Skills, that's a pretty good attack right there. I'd take that any day of the week. <laughs> to play beside Messi, I feel like I'm gonna do work. Barcelona at home to Valencia. Three minutes into the game, we're gonna start attacking right off the bat. Skills gives it down to Messi. Messi looking to make something happen. He goes back to Skills. Skills, the Portuguese man, making it happen. Weak footed. Left-footed, weak-footed, booyah. <laughs> it's in the back of the net. Your boy's skills goes hard in the fifth minute. And I got to go hard. The manager got to know that he has to play me. 23 million. I'm worth that. Start me. I'm going to give Barca points. Just put me in the starting 11 and watch me do my thing. <laughs> so I get another goal. I'm beasting and feasting right there. And Barca just needs to go hard. Barca needs to just keep doing what they did the first five minutes. But now we're going to see... Now we're going to see a little bit of BS in my opinion. Valencia is a very good team in real life. I'm not taking that away from them. But there's no way Valencia should be controlling the ball like this against Barcelona. And then look, look, look. Ah. FIFA 13. The BS of FIFA 13 is incredible. Valencia holds the ball on us. They control the ball like they're Barcelona in real life. And then the deflection falls right to them, and the game is tied up at 1. 14 minutes into this game, I'm going to get the ball. I'm going to get the ball. Here it is. Fabregas gives it to me. I find Messi. Messi in front of goal. How did he miss? Isn't he the best player in the world right now? Didn't he just win that trophy? It falls to his left foot, his good foot, and he misses. Or the goalie saves, I should say. But we should be going to halftime 2-1. to one. Maybe Messi does need to leave. What was that? <laughs> 45th minute. Nah, I'm just kidding. I hope my boy Messi doesn't leave. We need him on the team. We move forward. Inesta finds skills. Skills up to Messi. Messi and skills connecting like a beast. Messi back to skills. And ah! The Portuguese man hits it off the post. You know that you see how... Did you hear how low the stadium got? The stadium was quiet when the ball hit the post there. 48th minute, we're still attacking. Fabregas gives me the ball. I give it to Inesta. Back to Fabregas. Fabregas. Inesta. 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 Wow. Two times in the, off the post in the last 10 minutes. We could be up 3-1 to one if Messi would have scored his goal. If I would have scored the one off the post or maybe Inesta would have scored that. We could be winning this. But then something tragic happens. I call for the ball to get it out the backfield. I try to make a break for it. And then booyah. I'm done. That's it. I'm out for the count. I just dropped. They're calling me out. They're saying I can't play no more. A tough injury to take, especially when you're fighting for a starting 11 spot here at Barcelona. I'm disappointed, man. I was doing good, too. Fifth minute, I come out, get a beast goal. Then I almost supplied a goal to Messi. And now I'm out for four weeks. A sprained ankle is going to leave me out for four weeks. That means we're going to be simming through a lot of games. And what makes it worse, and as you can see, the objectives got a little bit lower. Now the manager pulls stuff down because I'm going to miss a lot of games. 
But what makes it worse is that that was our second game of the season, and we walked out of there with one point. So in two games, Barca leaves with one point. Now in three games, Barca still on one point in three games. You can see Real Madrid's doing well, seven points in three games. Messi not going anywhere. He's staying. The transfer window's closed, and Messi's not going nowhere. That's a big boost for Barcelona. Maybe they'll start playing better football. I'm still out, so I'm not going to be playing in the Portugal. And Portugal's qualifying for the Euro. They go up against Norway. Ronaldo got a goal, but Norway also scores one. That ends 1-1. One one. The next game in the Euro qualifier, Portugal, is actually finally going to pick up a win. Ronaldo with one, Nani with two. 3-1, to one, a big win. And now Barca with another game against Villarreal. Finally gets their first win of the season. Messi says he's not going nowhere, and they stay. So in four games... What do we got? Four points, four games? Ah, that's terrible. <laughs> As you can see here, I am back. I'm healthy. I'm able to play, but the manager decides not to play me yet because I am coming off of an injury recently. And look who it is. Barcelona going up against my favorite team in the entire world. Barcelona versus Benfica. And I don't want to commentate anymore. Let's talk about the weather outside. Don't watch the screen. Look outside your window. Tell me, is it snowing? Is it raining? Is this sunshine? Uh, right in the comments. Stop watching the gameplay. In the comments down below, is it raining? Snowing? <sighs> is that three now? It's not snowing here. It's actually pretty hot. It's been a hot winter. Not really that cold. It was pretty cold yesterday, but 4 nil. Come on, son. Ah, anyways, back to the gameplay. I didn't want to commentate on Portugal getting poo-pooed. I mean, on Bifica getting poo-pooed like that. So, the last game that I'll be sitting out, the next game I am going to start, it's Deportivo La Coruña taking on Barcelona, and Barcelona's going to pick up another win, so we're doing all right now.